Fire has always been part of our outback. We've used it to keep our people and country healthy. Now, Indigenous ranges and Indigenous protected areas bring traditional knowledge and modern science together to use fire to restore nature. We do that by lighting small fires in the right places at the right times. Smaller fires burn through dry leaves and grasses, but don't kill trees. This reduces big wildfires by making fire breaks. If dry leaves and grasses aren't burnt for a few years, and then a wildfire comes through, it burns hotter and faster over a larger area. That's not good for the bush or people for three main reasons. First, wildfires are dangerous. They threaten people and their homes and cost millions of dollars in damage every year. Second, the bigger the fire, the more greenhouse gas pollution. And last, fierce wildfires aren't good for wildlife. They kill everything in their path. Slow burning small fires, like the ones we use to make fire breaks, spark new seeds and growth by native plants, which make food and shelter for animals. Fire keeps our outback healthy, from the deserts to the bush, the landscapes that make Australians proud. And we need people on the ground to make that happen the right way. If we are going to save our country's most precious places, we need more Indigenous ranges and Indigenous protected areas. Join me in adding your voice to the Country Needs People campaign for long-term support for more Indigenous ranges and Indigenous protected areas.